Hey everybody, what's going on? I'm back with another Hot Wheels video today. And today I just wanted to go over some of my favorite Hot Wheels out of my collection. So I have all these different Hot Wheels right here on my little stand here. And these are the ones that I feel that are my favorite at the moment <laughs> that I have. We're gonna start right here. Shelby Cobra. Such a cool little car right here. Another cool part is that the hood also pops open too to reveal the little engine in there. I think that was really cool. And just the feel of this one is very solid. Very solid piece. And the nice light blue with the racing stripes on it. I always thought that was cool. And on the back here it has a crown and the Hot Wheels emblem. You know, I'm actually picking it over here. And I like this one for several reasons. Um, I've always really liked the four uh, four Cobras. Always really cool looking cars in general. And then the fact that I have a hollow, I really don't even remember where this one came from, but I've had this one for a great long while and I really enjoy it. I like the blue color on it. And even the wheels look pretty cool with the side pipes, side pipe exhaust. Wow. Next one I'm gonna talk about here is my little uh, it's a Corvette Stingray prototype. Pretty cool. It's green. It's got the light green ghost flames on it. And a number six for for racing car number. And then even the windshields here. The windshields plural. The windshields here look really cool. And I like how it has um, a line running all the way from the hood right through where the windshields are. This looks really cool. You got the vents right there. Of course, being a, a Corvette, it's got the side pipes on that side and this side. And even this one actually has a crown on it too. Number six with a crown. This is pretty cool as well. Very cool looking design on this vehicle as well. The next has this Ford Vicky. I believe it was a 34. Let's see. Oh, excuse me, 1932 Ford Vicky. I really enjoy the shape of this vehicle. It's more like a, almost like an SUV sedan type of deal here. I really like the front fenders, how they kind of curve over the front right there. You got the engine sitting all exposed. And then we have Never Again with the, with the heart and the flames on there. On the top and the Hot Wheels, with the heart and the Hot Wheels flame on there even back to the exhaust pipes at the back. I always just really like the way this one looks. Very cool. Next, I believe this is a Lotus Exceed with the number 12 on it. Let's see. Ooh, I need it though. I'm not sure. But, I believe this is a Lotus Exceed. That is what this is. But I really like the body design on this car as well. It's very small, got the big spoiler in the back, has the has a, has a roof scoop on there, I guess for more air ventilation for the race car. I really like the front hood there as well, with the little, I guess, divots right there. The wheels are kind of cool on this one as well. It's a darker green, darker green color. But very cool. And then next, we got Pontiac Banshee. This one has been a favorite with me ever since I did the concept car corner video on it. This one has just really stuck with me. This is one of the, um, one from the Robo Zoo collection. And this one has the elephant on it. Very cool looking car. Man, this thing is so cool. I just love the body design. It's very flowing, almost like it, almost like it looks like an arrow. Just very flowing all the way through the body line. And even you got the, it's the windshield and then the doors, or the, the windows, <laughs> the windows there. And you got like a, a V kind of shape here on the top. Very cool. This next one here. 
this one, I've had this one for a very long while, and I've always thought the way the prowler looks in particular is just very, very cool. It has like the, the fenders, the, the front fenders, it has the curves over there, and then the body itself almost looks like, I guess, an arrow again, of course. You kind of see the front tip there, all the way back. And it has even some blue surfboards, you can go surfing. I really enjoy this purple color on it as well. And even the metallic is still pretty sparkly, even though these are fairly old, I've had them for a minute. But I really do enjoy the way this vehicle looks as well. I'm going to go on to here number eight car with the giant exposed from the windshield all the way to the hood even to the rear spoiler here almost looks more like a like a like a compact hatch almost. I'm not even sure what this is Ooh, it's a super net very cool though and it's got what looks to be I guess a gorilla face on the sides with the eight Prime on there, very cool with the orange and the black, and how, how it's all mixed in back there, very cool. You can even see the seats and the steering wheel all in it, and it's got these silverish, not even sure what you call it, I guess, <laughs> they're like, um, it starts with the headlights, but it kind of moves back through the hood there. Very cool looking car, I've always really liked looking at this one as well. And then this, the number three, I'm not even sure what this thing is, but man is it cool. And this, this really looks like an arrow. <laughs> like a lot of these kind of have that arrow shaped body to it. Very aerodynamic, let's see what it is. It's called the Turbo Flame, oh yeah. So you got the flames out the back there too, the plastic flames, you got your engine and the exhaust ports. Of course on the side you got Hot Wheels. Number three. And then even, even the chassis underneath, the flame chassis looks really cool. Really cool looking hot wheel. And last but not least, we have here, which I guess is technically not a hot wheel, but um, it's a Maizo. <laughs> Maizo, I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but it's the Lamborghini Miura. For the longest while I have been absolute love with the Lamborghini Miura and I, once again I don't really remember when I got this this one in particular but I've had it a minute I've still got it in the box and it's got that that beautiful yellow color on it very cool looking hot wheel and even if you can see on the hood there it's got the little hood vents the shape of this vehicle is just really really interesting to me well just at a glance after a while of not seeing my Hot Wheel collection, these are some of my favorite Hot Wheels vehicles. I like them a lot because of all the different designs and then the body lines and the body styles that they have on them. And then just the fact that the things like the Turbo Flame here, the Super Nat and the Banshee are all very, very creative. Very creative, even down to the paint job. Really, really enjoy these very much. Well, everybody, that's it. Um, this is just my, my my favorites of my Hot Wheels collection thus far. I'm sure I'm going to get many more, but for now, these are the ones I really like and really enjoy looking at, and I'm very glad I have them. Um, so please tell me, do you have any Hot Wheels? What are, your, what are some of your favorite Hot Wheels? And that's pretty much the end of the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe.